Yeah, you saw that right. FT8 on a cell phone. Howdy everybody, Steve here, KM9G. This is pre-beta, pre-alpha software. This is pretty early on in its development, but I am ridiculously impressed. This is pretty amazing. This is FT8CN. There will be a link in the description down below so you can play along and have all the fun that you want. There are some bugs. It's not finished being made yet. So look at it and go, ooh, I like where this is going. Don't look at it and go, what did I pay for? Because you didn't pay for it. So let's get into it. All right, let's get after installing it. Go out to the GitHub page linked in the description down below. Click on the APK file. Your browser is going to prompt you to download it. Go ahead and download it. Once it is fully downloaded, click the open button. It'll ask you if you want to update, if you've already installed it. If you haven't already installed it, it'll ask you for a whole bunch of security permissions and verify that, you know, you did indeed mean to do this. And then it launches. This is pretty slick. So all the stuff you'd expect, call sign, grid square, different methods of cat control. Check out all these radios this thing supports. And there's more in the way. And if it just does sound over USB, you're good to go anyway. All the different frequencies you'd expect are there. And then we are decoding. It really is that simple. Long press on a contact and pick call. And now you're calling. You can see in the bottom the calling status. So now I'm going to call WB2BIN. And this was one of my favorite things. This is the waterfall. This is an active waterfall. This is exactly what you'd expect to see on your SDR screen. But, but it gets better. As you start getting down towards the bottom of the decode and you actually have decoded stuff, poof. They show up in the waterfall. Oh, that's awesome. So you can see who's talking. You can actually see where they're talking in the waterfall and who they're talking to. And it works for both even and odd, as you'd expect. Oh, this was my favorite view. The map view. And it gets better. Look at this. Grid squares. These are squares that have heard me or I have heard. The QSX. And then you can see where the conversations are going to and fro. Kind of like having Grid Tracker all built into one app. So the D, the I, and the C icons indicate uh, whether you whether these are new signals or not. So D is DXCC, I is ITU, I forget what C is. So that's IM86. That's the station that I worked before. EN35 is me. Oh, somebody's calling me. KI5HZX in Texas. So that's pretty neat. Minus four. I am super impressed with this thing. I really like the world map grid tracker style view where you can see where your contacts are going back and forth. I can see this being a much better thing to do than crossword puzzles on your cell phone while you're pretending to watch TV. You know, we all know that you're doing FTA contacts on your phone. This reminds me of SDR control, but it is available for Android. It will work over USB. It will work over Wi-Fi. It will work over Bluetooth. It will work over smoke signal. I don't know. I think I ran out of things that'll work over. He's got a lot of radios that are listed in there as support. This is a pre-alpha app. This is 0.86 version of this software, and there are some crashing type bugs and so forth, so don't expect this to work 100% out of the gate. Like I did, take a look at this in terms of, oh my god, this thing is amazing. I just love where it's going, and I want to try this. If you want to try it, there is a link in the description down below. If you're watching it on your cell phone, click it now. Go do it. If you've got a 705 that's set up for Wi-Fi, you can do the whole thing right from where you're sitting, hopefully. Um, I tried it with the X6100 and the 705 because those were the two radios that I had handy. But any radio that has the ability to be controlled over USB will work. And look forward to more and more updates as this thing comes out. There's a video right over here I think you will enjoy next. Thanks for being awesome. I'll see you over there.